Okay. Uh, what did we want to scrap? Let's scrap that. We're not thirsty. Jesus. I don't even have any upgrades in, uh, in camel, and yet yeah, this dude's go running, running strong without having to drink anything. My character is too OP. Clearly. check out the roof. For the longest time I always forgot that other passing gases have roofs too that you can loot. Uh, we don't need feathers. Zombies tar uh, sighted and got him. We need wood. Not really. Not that little amount. Besides, we had like an entire forest to uh, to fucking harvest back home. So. I think this road takes us straight into that one village. Pretty sure. Yeah, right here. And there's gonna be a lot of zombies here too. Oh boy, another, uh, and I didn't even loot these houses yet. Oh dear. So this will be another, uh, another fucking stop and have, oh, and, and besides, the, there are still the zombie bodies from earlier when we stopped by here earlier. And I forgot to go over to the, uh, the airdrop behind me. God damn it. So many delays. Whoops, that was a miss. That was a miss too. <laughs> Sniping with the Magnum is so fun. Of course, there are some zombies up here somewhere. <laughs> Just gonna break open these doors with my magnum because I don't care. <laughs> Alright, let's start searching all of you bitches. This is one I really wish I had a uh, a my crew cree so that uh, cutting up all the zombie buys would take would take not a lot of time because kukris can uh, one shot zombie bodies whereas a knife a hunting knife like this can't. I think that kukris have to be at least 250 quality, maybe 300. Hence why Kukri's are a rare spawn. A very rare loot spawn. Yeah, that's another uh, zombie. And now he's dead. Yeah, the Magnum is crazy in this game. I don't know, I don't even want to know how much damage it'll do to a human. Or like a player, a player character. Because you start out with base, um... 100 health. I don't know how much zombie, how much health zombies have. I'm pretty sure it, it says it says what their health is on the wiki, but like, goddamn, Magnum is strong. Magnum is strong. It's thick and strong. Was 
I stepping on a body? No. Thought I was for a moment. Blade Weapons is now level 71. Cool. Now just like another fucking 500 zombie bodies and it'll go up to like 800. <laughs> level 800 in, uh, or not 800, what the fuck. Level 80 in a uh, blade skill. Alright, get rid of this. Hop on my bike. You know what? We're just gonna say fuck the uh, airdrop. Because it's gonna stay there. Since it's not like we need to worry about it. I hear zombies. I will go investigate and kill them. Shocking time. Whoops, I missed. That's alright. Breaching. Sal's got a uh, fucking swimming pool and everything outside here. And before there were like zombie sharks in there, it's like oh, shit. <laughs> That's cool how you can actually shoot zombies through the, uh, through these things. Don't hate that. Yeah, it's super cool. Zombie body just teleported up here for some reason. I think there's another zombie somewhere around here. Uh, yes. Let's see. We call that the pistol whip from where I'm from. Maybe I really should have brought along a spare hunting knife. This one's about to go bad already. Right. Since so I know there was a bookcase in here, I'm just gonna search these bookcases for extra schematics. What do you know? Oh shit, didn't mean to do that. Killers. Yeah. You can move the bike up. So I'm just gonna leave the airdrop where it is right now, and I'll search for, and I'll go back for it uh, when we're coming back from Perishton. Considering we only have six hours left, ugh, really did spend too long here, <laughs> as we always do. <laughs> Thank you. 
just kind of wonder how much EXP I get for uh, each uh, knife swing on a zombie body. I guess the answer would be not a lot. Okay, let's map our way over to Parishton. <laughs> 